Hello, my name is Lalit Kapoor. I'm diet and lifestyle coach. Today, uh, we'll talk about the issue of uh, various uh, guidelines which are often conflicting. Guidelines related to things such as uh, blood pressure or blood sugar. Now, for people who are suffering from diabetes, today there are three different guidelines. One guideline is by ADA, American Diabetics Association, and they recommend that you bring your A1C below 7.0. The second guideline is by AACE, American Association of Clinical Endocrinologists. Their guideline recommends that you bring down your A1C with medications to a point of 6.5 or lower. On January, on, on March 5th, 2018, American College of Physicians, ACP, introduced their recommendations and their recommendations say that you should maintain your A1C under eight, somewhere between 7.0 and 8.0. The main uh, reason for their recommendation is what we in the scientific community call J-curve. And uh, as you can see the J-curve on the slide, when we consume too much medication and control our symptoms very tightly, they also harm us. And when we have symptoms which are very high, like high blood pressure or high blood glucose levels or high A1C, they are also harmful. So the best results are somewhere in between. On this curve, if higher the you are, that means your cause your chances of all-cause mortality are high. The lower you are on vertical axis, the lower are your chances of all-cause mortality. So people uh, have been complaining about this. Some of the senior doctors uh, have been complaining that we have gone overboard in controlling the symptoms. And uh, American College of Physicians, which is a much larger body than uh, American Diabetics Association or AACE. So there's less conflict of interest. And there are members from all walks of medical profession. So it is very important that we make ourselves aware of these specifications and uh, follow them. Similarly, for blood pressure, the Joint National Committee number eight, which was the last one, came out with their findings and they suggested that for people under the age of 60, the blood pressure should only be controlled to a point of 140 over 90. Any lower is actually causing more harm. So controlling your BP with medications to a point of 120 over 80 or 125 over 85 is actually harming you more than you would ever realize. For people over the age of 60, the cutoff for prescribing medication as per JNC 14, JNC 8 guideline is 150 over 90. So a lot of senior people who come across my courses, they are con taking medications and they're controlling their blood pressure at levels of 125 over 85. They should not be doing that. They really need to consult their physician and, and tell them that I understand that the JNC recommended, the last recommendation by JNC is a 140 over 90 or 150 over 90. Similarly, if you are a diabetic patient, and I come across all the time, 
they show, they come and tell me that my doctor is very good, he's controlling my A1C at 5.8. If your A1C is 5.8 with medications or with insulin, your doctor is not very good. Your doctor is not doing the right thing. Your A1C should be under 8. It could be 7.9, 7.8. ACP gives a range 7.0 to 8.0, but if 7.0 is as good as 8.0, obviously to maintain it at 7.0, you are taking excessive medication. So please pay attention to it and talk to your doctor and emphasize to him that you would like to bring it in, in, in a line with what uh, current recommendations are by American College of Physicians and in case of blood pressure by Joint National Committee number eight. Thank you so much. This is Lalit Kapoor again. Bye-bye.